Hey, what's happening guys? Mike Moo here. My Narbox is finally here. Oh my God, it's been like a year late. This is the 512 gigabyte version and it has the 2.0 battery and uh, SSD supposedly all in here. So this comes in from Gilroy, California and let's see what's inside. Woohoo! Here it is, the Narbox 2.0 SSD in all its glory. Ooh, finally, finally, finally. Wow, packaging is really nice. Reminds me of something you would get in an Apple product. Oh, please excuse my setup. I just wanted to get this out. So this for you, Kickstarter backers, you should check up an update. The 512 gigabyte units are shipping first and they started shipping last week. However, since they came out from Gilroy, California, it took a little while to get down here to SoCal. So here, Monday, it's finally here. All right, so must say this is definitely worthy of an unboxing because this actually feels like Christmas. And I really appreciate the packaging uh, they definitely had a long time to think about it. it. Says right here in the box Narbox 2, 512 gigabyte SSD, Narbox 2.0 battery, Narbox micro SD uh, reader, Narbox USB C to C cable, Narbox power adapter, international power adapters, and a carrying lanyard. Specifications have changed just a little bit. Uh, I believe everybody now gets four gigabytes of RAM, whereas before they were split between two and four gigabytes. Three to six hours of continuous use. Wow, that's going to be something else. You know, I had the first version of the Narbox, and unfortunately, after my testing, I didn't have really great things to say about it. I was running on an early firmware, so I just wanted to hold off because I really appreciated what it is that they were doing and building. And of course, through the efforts, and uh, of the past few years, it finally resulted in today. Okay, so it looks like I didn't even have to open up this top part. I could have just slid right out. Yeah, yeah. must say this definitely feels very uh, rugged definitely has a really nice feel to it actually you know what this actually feels like something that was designed to be completely used outdoors which is exactly what they were advertising this is a little bit looser than I thought it would be uh, to be honest but um, you know the weatherproofing is there the seals are there I just wish that this had some sort of locking mechanism to keep any weather out but it opens with ease. And I suppose if you drop it, it's not going to be a bit of a problem. Well, for the most part, unless you toss it or something. So this is where the battery goes right over here. Very sleek. You know, this this gray reminds me very much of DJI products. And of course, we have the pogo type uh, pins that connect right up here. And does this charge separately? No, this is why you would have had to back the uh, extra external dual charger. I didn't go for that option because honestly, backing all those options, I was really afraid that if you, if I chose something that was a little bit more out of the ordinary, it's going to take a little while with delays and shipping. And sure enough, it was uh, delayed, but everybody got delayed. All right. Impressions of the battery pack. This part is a little bit soft right here. There's a little bit of indentation here. That part is not quite up to snuff, but you know what? It's a battery pack, and as long as it does its job, is uh, 3,000 milliamp hours, 7.6 volts, 22.8 watt hours. And then there's a little data code. This is made in Taiwan. Then I'm just going to be happy with it. Plus, is there some sealing? Yes, there is some weatherproof sealing all around here. Okay, pop that sucker right in there. Oh, look at that. Hold right to start. It's got. It's shipped a 30% battery. Of course, I'm obviously gonna be charging this right up as soon as possible. Over here, we got the user manual. 
and we'll take a look at that. Now, since uh, this is version 2.0, I'm presuming I'm gonna to have to download a new app. Warranty information, leave a little bit of review, and the quick start guide. All right, we'll deal with that a little bit later. First thing is to get this up and charged. All right, so they have what appears to be a QC charger. Ooh, nice. It's got a regular USB and USB-C. And this is a USB type C PD. So it is a 35 watt charger. This reminds me very much of the of an anchor type equivalent. Plus we have some adapters that you can go ahead and switch out, which is a very nice touch. We got the Narbox branded micro SD adapter. And of course the Narbox branded USB-C cable. Let's take a quick look at that. Feels really nice, actually. This this cable feels very solid. Definitely impressive. So they, they went for the details, guys. This feels like a really solid USB-C cable, probably the most solid USB-C cable that I have, um, that I now own. And of course, it's got the Narbox branding. Very nice touch. I'm gonna go ahead and plug this into charge and bust out the user manual. So uh, I guess that is it for this quick little unboxing. I am really pumped to be able to have this and to be able to use this soon. It has come over a year later and there was a little bit of a tease back in March about this being available at Santa Monica if I only went to go to the event to try it out and to pick up my unit. Of course, there were even more delays, but it is, of course, finally here. All right, so we got multiple USB. You know what, it's been so long, I'm really gonna have to read up on the specs to figure out what else has been changed since the update. Um, every time there was an update, actually, I, I, I mean, I, it wasn't a matter of whether or not Narbox was going to deliver. It was kind of a matter of, um, you know, when was it gonna arrive, and every time there was a delay, I just got a little bit more, uh, shall we say, a little bit disappointed, a little bit depressed, so I stopped reading a good part of them until it said it was shipping. All right, once again, this is coming in from Gilroy, California. And uh, for those of you guys that are looking for it, it is coming from, oh, where's that box? It is specifically coming from MYGNAR Distribution Center from Gilroy, California. So look, for, look out for that via UPS. And this might show up in your doorstop. That was nice, they attached the lanyard loop already there for me. Okay, time to get this puppy charged up. Please like, subscribe for more, and I will catch you next video. Let me know if there's anything you want me to test right away. Obviously, after I get this charge, I'm gonna get this thing right to work. Thanks for watching, I'll catch you in the next video.